GPs warn doctor scarcity endangers patient care. GPs in England find it more and more difficult to provide safe treatment. When physicians decrease and demand increases, a top medical scientist says. GP numbers have decreased by 4.5% despite an aging population and increasing need for care. GPs feared making severe errors as a result of their heavy workloads, he said. The government pledged in 2015 to recruit 5,000 more GPs within five years, however, the Royal College of GPs reports that from September 2020 to March 2021, the number of GPs decreased by 1,307 to 28,096. At the 2019 election, then Health Secretary Matt Hancock acknowledged that they had fallen short of the recruitment goal, while the Conservatives pledged to hire 6,000 more general practitioners by 2025. Professor Marshall said that the increased demand for GP services, particularly more complicated consultations, and the immunization program, combined with the decrease in population, was straining family physicians. Due to the tremendous pressures on general practice, it is unable to provide the patient-centered services that it desires. Many GPs are even having difficulty maintaining a safe service, he said. He told family physicians that 50 or 60 patients were most likely to err if they worked 11 or 12-hour days. Professor Marshall Chairman of the Royal College of GPs commented at a time when GPs have been chastised for the difficulties some patients have in getting face-to-face -face consultations. According to the Health Service Journal, one coroner mentioned the possibility of remote consultations during inquests into five different fatalities. In order to keep personnel secure and prevent spreading the illness, Professor Marshall stated remote assignments were needed during this epidemic. He said that many patients preferred them since they were more convenient. However, although he claimed that they were provided to patients who absolutely needed personal meetings, GPs literally struggled to fulfill patients' demands for such consultations. The Royal College of General Practitioners is asking for an immediate rescue package to help surgeries, including the hiring of 6,000 additional GPs and 26,000 support personnel including healthcare professionals and office staff by 2024. The Prime Minister stated on Tuesday that he would give more money to alleviate strain on the NHS for the next three years. This levy is to be granted.